Ray Porcio at topvelocity.net. And you're going to do a pitchers analysis here of Sowell, and we're going to pair him up with Stephen Lacey on the left. We'll take them both out of leg lift. So we can see Stephen here is initially shifting his min- momentum forward, leading through his hip pretty aggressively. If we take him all the way down to port before his leg drive, we see also he gets very linear on that back leg force vector. Um, something around 40, 45. We can see here Sol is Sol is is too way too vertical. Not a perfect side view here, so you really can't see the angle. But I would assume that his force vector is somewhere you know 10, 15 degrees more vertical. We can also see Steve when he does really well is as he's aligning his force vector, he closes off his shoulders really well. So when he opens and goes in the front foot and drives, you can see even as he's driving, it's it's moving this plate here. The king of the hill is moving. So he's losing some power from that king of the hill being unstable. He hits front foot and has, you know, as he's hitting front foot, he has some good hip rotation. And then as he stabilizes, he has a lot of hip rotation. If we watch Sol here, as he goes in front foot, He's very vertical. He tempts some extension, some drive, but it's very vertical. And there he hits front foot, and he's tucking glove early. We can see Steven really keeping his glove closed. So when he lands, he's in an open hip or open trunk position, as opposed to Steven in a closed trunk position. So we see a lot more hip to shoulder separation here than than what we see it with Sol. So, and that what that causes is everything to go early. You know, so for the, the, the momentum, the force vector staying vertical, everything went up. We can see the trunk finishing up. We can see the arm trying to finish the pitch and way in front of the, sh- uh, the face. As we see Steven, his trunk carries forward as his, his arm lays back, and then we see his arm go forward. So a lot that Sol can hit here to improve You know, the linear force vectors, the more momentum at a leg lift. Uh, the more linear drive into front foot, a more open hip position, a more closed shoulder orientation like Steven here, and then ultimately seeing that all translate so much better with a more forward trunk as opposed to more forward uh, f- uh, forearm position or elbow position at release.